Well, our top story tonight takes us to the Henderson County courtroom where the former Coffee City Chief of Police appeared today. John J. Portillo is facing six felony car counts for reportedly lying on his job application for the chief position with Coffee City PD. The charges were filed after the former chief was fired for his hiring practices as well as his own legal troubles. It also resulted in the police department being deactivated in September of 2023. Fox 51's Ashlyn Anderson was in court today and has an update on where the case stands. The next time John J. Portillo comes back to this courthouse could be in October to face a jury trial. Portillo's legal team and the state were not able to come to an agreement regarding a plea deal back in April. The terms of that deal have not yet been disclosed. Portillo is charged with six counts of tampering with government documents for allegedly lying on his job application with Coffee City. The counts have to do with Portillo reportedly omitting a DUI arrest in Florida, along with other disciplinary actions while employed in Harrison County here in Texas. We spoke with his attorney after today's court hearing. He tells us a jury trial may not be necessary if both sides make a deal. Take a listen. At the end of the day, there's always discovery that could come out. There's continuing investigations, um, breakdown in communication sometimes occur, and then they pick back up in negotiations. So we'll see. Portillo's attorney goes on to say it's best for both sides to try and resolve before it reaches jury trial, adding he will do his job and push as far as he can for his client. We also spoke if Portillo was prepared to plead guilty given the right circumstances, and his attorney asked to respect his client's privacy. Also in court today was former Coffee City Mayor Frank Serrato. He is also charged with six counts of tampering with government documents. His court date is rescheduled for a later date. In Henderson County, Ashland Anderson, Fox 51 News.